so Drawbridge, uh, we've been a business since 2011. We're headquartered in San Mateo. We, our mission is kind of to democratize identity to empower both consumers and marketers. We are backed by top VCs, Sequoia, Kleiner, Northgate Capital. We've got 160 employees as of today. We've got new ones starting every day and we definitely are hiring in every department. And then we give uh, customers two ways to engage. So we license what we call our identity data for marketing, ad tech, and non-ad tech applications. We also enable brands and uh, enterprises to license our platform. So our platform is basically to run digital ad campaigns. And you can do that as a managed service, or you can do that on a self-service basis. We have been privileged to win awards for our culture, our technology and innovation, uh, our growth, and uh, also our entrepreneurship. Uh, so there's kind of a bevy of those. I'd like to talk about today's digital reality by stepping back a little bit. Uh, in the good old days before the internet, it was easy for marketers to reach consumers. They ran TV ads, radio ads, print ads, or outdoor ads. But since then, uh, with the internet and the explosion of smart devices, choices for consumers to consume media and choices for marketers to have, connect with con consumers have kind of ballooned. We've got smartphones, smart watches, smart cars, uh, tablets, uh, we've got social media, we've got apps, we've got mobile video, all sorts of things, all sorts of channels and ways for consumers and marketers to engage. That's kind of, uh, right now it's um, off of uh, a total pool of three and a half billion consumers. And this is the case for all of them that are, have access to the internet today. And for the largest brands and enterprises, the trouble is, how do you reach those consumers? And to compound that, those consumers are carrying around over 5 billion devices. So that's smartphones, tablets, PCs, all of those things. And that's just, quote unquote, including the, uh, the digital devices, not the internet of things that are coming and uh, the toasters and uh, smart light bulbs that are coming. And in three years, that number is going to more than double to about 13.5 billion devices. So when we look at these two numbers, that's about three devices per user. What this has caused, this device proliferation, has pretty much caused uh, consumer identities to become fragmented across those devices. So if you think about your behavior on each device, it's very different. You might have a, a laptop that you use as corporate and you do your work on that. You might go home on the weekends and your tablet is kind of like your guilty pleasure and you're consuming very different content using very different apps. And then your cell phone might be a mix between the two. You're on the train, you're watching videos, and then you're all business when you finally get to work. So the challenge is to compound this identity fragmentation. And I think there's what we call the walled gardens. There's big platforms that have solved this and they've solved this by requiring users to log in. So when you log in, you get that seamless personalized experience across all of your devices. So it's the Amazon-like effect, it's the Facebook effect, it's the Google effect, and even the Netflix effect. The trouble is, how do you get that experience for the rest of the web when you don't have that login data? How can you build that same seamless personal environment for everybody? And that's exactly what Drawbridge has solved. Today, we empower brands to deliver that seamless personalized experience for their consumers, their customers, without requiring a login. It's an anonymized identity solution. Oops. So what's basically defensible at our te about our technology? We recently had our methodology patented by the US government, which is a nice moat to build around it. Our verified precision, so we're talking about anonymized identity, not a deterministic ones, so we don't have personally identifiable information. It's our algorithm that stitches your relationship and your devices together to build your notion of identity in our system. Nielsen verified its accuracy against a true set of data at 97.3% accurate. So it's almost like as much as having that known reason of identity. And then we've spent the last six years building a truly unremarkable global scale that rivals those walled gardens to talk about our scale. So in our database, we have a billion monthly active uniques. That's a billion consumers individually identified. And that equates across their devices to about 75% of total device coverage in major global markets. So this level of coverage enabled us to uh, 
our technology to deploy via several applications. The first one to market was I talked about that digital app, that digital advertising solution. So that was both digital advertising for targeting and for attribution. So that enables you to target consumers and also attribute uh, purchases um, and other activities, both online and offline. So even if we show an ad to on a mobile phone, we can prove that that ad made that person go into the store and buy stuff. Uh, we've also talked about other uh, other applications such as e-commerce recommendations, content optimization and personalization, and we're even getting into the security industry. So again, branching out of ad tech into MarTech and even security. I guess our ultimate goal, uh, we're trying to show the true value of identity by enabling that personalization and, and uh, beyond just advertising to touch online uh, consumer experiences everywhere. So think of all your content being synchronized. So this person's a Warriors fan. You could have that truly uh, unique, seamless experience without having to log in. I think that's the crux of it. So today, this, some of this is an aspirational goal, but soon I think it will be reality thanks to Drawbridge's technology. So thank you.